Philip, how does the TDWI define data governance? Well, you know, at TDWI, we think of data governance as a, uh, uh, a, a mixture of people and process. So there's typically people on some kind of committee or board, and uh, these people are quite often a mixture of technical and business folks. And, of course, nowadays a lot of people are hybrids, right? They're sort of half business, half, half uh, 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 technology. And so you typically find hybrids like stewards uh, and data architects and things like that on the committee. So these people come together uh, for a variety of reasons, and uh, they quite often come from two completely different directions. For a lot of folks, uh, data governance is put together uh, to uh, deal with some sort of uh, compliance issue that may be regulatory. It may be uh, some partnering standards you have to comply with. It could be about uh, security and data privacy. Uh, and then from the other direction, people come at it from technology. They just want to have uh, some kind of process like governance to help them improve data quality, the integratability of data across multiple business units, uh, to improve uh, development standards, and so on and so forth. So uh, you put all these people together, and that's really governance. And the process then kicks off of they propose, uh, uh, they propose some policies uh, for uh, how we control uh, the access and dissemination of information. Quite often that's a compliance issue. Or they uh, kick off processes where uh, they're defining policies that define data standards and more technical issues. So again, it's quite a mix, but all of that is data governance.